too. Neda's goal is to give kids an early start in appreciating wild Mustangs. When children want to go and learn about horses or meet horses, they, they usually only have a stable to go to, where horses are kept and managed in small stalls and ridden. I wanted to create an environment where children could come and have a relationship with horses in their world, in their environment. Once a month, Return to Freedom offers a wild horse encounter to cross-cultural children's groups. And it all begins with a lesson on becoming one with the herd. Walk right up. Reach out your hand. Scratch her. There you go. There you go. Hold your hand out. <laughs> there you go. There you go. <laughs> what I think programs like Return to Freedom brings to the kids is that they get to get out of the city, they get to a place where they can get into nature, they can start to realize that we're all one in a way. Okay, a long time ago on this continent, Native Americans often painted their horses um, to bring them different things like good luck and protection during a hunt. Today we're going to paint these horses for peace. Let's decorate this pony. For the kids, the best part of the day is their very own wild horse walking adventure. The horses normally don't come in, and to see the whole group of children get circled so gently. I think that the, the horses really got to see what the spirit of the kids were. There was just a, a beautiful exchange of energy that happened with the spirit of the horse and the innocence of the child. <laughs> 